Nistatin, also known as Niamic 100,000 unit slash gram topical powder, is used to treat fungal skin infections. It is an antifungal medication that works by stopping the growth of fungus. It is important to apply this medication exactly as prescribed by your doctor. Typically, it is applied to the affected area two to three times daily or as directed by your physician. It is best to use it at the same times each day to help you remember. Make sure to continue using this medication for the full prescribed length of time, even if your symptoms improve before the infection is completely cleared. This will help prevent the infection from returning. In order to use Niamic 100,000 unit slash gram topical powder, you should only apply it to the skin. Make sure to clean and completely dry the area before applying the medication. Your doctor will instruct you on how often to apply it, usually two or three times a day. The amount and duration of treatment will depend on the type of infection being treated, so make sure to follow your doctor's directions carefully. Apply enough powder to lightly cover the affected area and some of the surrounding skin. After applying the medication, remember to wash your hands unless you are using it to treat your hands. Avoid wrapping, covering, or bandaging the area unless your doctor tells you to do so. If using it in the diaper area on an infant, do not use tight-fitting diapers or plastic pants. Do not apply this medication in the eyes, nose, mouth, or vagina. For the best results, use this medication regularly at the same times each day. It's important to continue using it until the full prescribed amount is finished, even if your symptoms improve before then. Stopping the medication too early may cause the infection to return. If your condition lasts after two weeks of treatment or gets worse at any time, be sure to inform your doctor. If you experience skin irritation or redness, it's important to notify your doctor or pharmacist. However, many people using this medication do not have serious side effects. While a serious allergic reaction to this drug is rare, it's important to seek medical help right away if you notice symptoms such as rash, itching slash swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. Keep in mind that this is not a complete list of possible side effects, so if you notice any other effects, it's best to contact your doctor or pharmacist. And if you're in the US, you can report side effects to the FDA, or in Canada, you can report them to Health Canada. Before using Niamic 100,000 unit slash gram topical powder, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies, as this product may contain inactive ingredients that could cause allergic reactions or other issues. It's also important to discuss your medical history with your doctor or pharmacist before using this medication. If you have any upcoming surgery, be sure to inform your doctor or dentist about all the products you are using, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. If you are pregnant, this medication should only be used when clearly needed, so be sure to discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. Additionally, it is unknown if this drug passes into breast milk, so consult your doctor before breastfeeding while using Niamic 100,000 unit slash gram topical powder. It's important to be aware of potential drug interactions when using Niamic 100,000 unit slash gram topical powder. Certain medications may interact with Niamic, affecting how it works or increasing the risk of serious side effects. Be sure to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. It's crucial not to start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. Always consult with your healthcare provider before making any changes to your medication routine. If Niamic 100,000 unit slash gram topical powder is swallowed, it can be harmful and may cause nausea, vomiting, or stomach upset. If someone has overdosed and is experiencing serious symptoms like passing out or trouble breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help by calling 911 or a poison control center. U.S. residents can call their local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, and Canada residents can call a provincial poison control center. Remember, it's crucial to keep this medication out of reach of children to prevent accidental ingestion. It's important that you do not share this medication with others. The doctor has prescribed this medication specifically for your current condition. It is not advisable to use it for another infection unless your doctor instructs you to do so. If you forget to use the medication at the scheduled time, you can use it as soon as you remember. 
However, if it's almost time for your next dose, it's better to skip the missed dose and continue with your regular dosing schedule. Avoid taking double the dose to make up for the missed one. Just use the next dose at the usual time. Make sure to store Niamic 100,000 units slash gram topical powder at room temperature and away from children and pets. Do not flush this medication down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless instructed. When it is expired or no longer needed, be sure to properly discard it. You can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for more information on how to do this. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.